Welcome back to the Hearthstone Battlegrounds. My turn. JJ played last time. Spoiler alert, JJ. How do you how do you play last time? This one. How do you play last time? How'd it go? I did okay. Yeah. I I, I feel like that's the best that's way fine. to put it. Right. Yeah, that's fine. It was I. Right. Could have been better. Could have been worse. Go watch it if you care to know more about it. Um, this is the hunt for five thousand rating points, which if we make a positive result, we should be able to get. In this one, which means that we probably what 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 you place fourth and get plus nine points. <laughs> that would be a cool number, though. I'll take it. That, that, these forty nine ninety nine. Forty nine ninety nine. All right, these are. Forty nine. Get one for free. These are all very dubious heroes. Great. Ooh. Curator's interesting for sure. I the weird thing is I I know which one I would pick. Yeah, you're a weird person, so you probably pick Lich, like mm -hmm. so, because of recent experience. But I think Curator is probably the best. So I'll take. Just bring I, him in. Just I feel like whenever I play Give Curator, it. the Amalgam doesn't do much is the problem. Yeah. But you start off with an Amalgam. And yeah. we know how an Amalgam is the best thing in, in Battlegrounds, right? But I feel like whenever I play the Curator, I get the regular Amalgam, which is <laughs> not a bad thing. The more Amalgams are never but, bad. Uh, Board I think my Curator sets weren't even that good. Alright, I, I gotta, um, gotta see what we got. Okay, so definitely a pretty decent lineup there. Got a Nefarian, got an Edwin. Actually, um... I don't think you have any, like, really great Rafa characters there. Rafa's I think it's pretty good. I think it's a pretty, like, average lineup. I'm not fair, and Edwin and Rafa are, are elite. Elise is okay, Ragnar's is okay. Allegedly, Dancing Daryl is the GOAT, I think he's trash. I don't know. Sylvanas, I haven't seen so much happen from that yet, but it's probably fine. I was, I was low-key just waiting to see if you were completely gonna miss buying a minion on one. I'm a professional, JJ. You know I never do. <laughs> I have I have not bought a minion on one before previously, but that's when there was literally nothing I wanted and I just rolled. It happened. It has happened before. Rare, though. I can't recommend it. I also cannot. Because you can just buy anything, upgrade on two, and then just yeah. start rolling after. I doubt I won that run, actually. Since I don't have any big synergies at this point, I'm gonna just upgrade this, I think. Just uh, see what I can get turn uh, tier 2 wise. Is it Malcolm 2 or 3? It's 3, right? Malcolm's 2. It's 2. Ooh! That's a, the that's a whole Ooh. thing. It's, it's way too low. Yeah, it's way too low, man. It should be 3. A Malcolm turn 2, uh, tier 2. That's, that's pretty good. It's pretty good if you ask me. Alright, we got Sylvanas. What, what are we doing here? Alright, that probably hasn't taken place yet. Supposedly. But the hero power probably has not taken place. For Sylvanas probably hasn't used it yet. I mean, that's fair enough. Yeah. yeah. So that's good. And I got the self zero every single time, so well, both times so far has just given you what? the exact Dude, thing that you Without the starting smack. amalgam, we would have took two L's. Two out of two. Amalgam already paid off. And, and there's a regular of, amalgam. Oh, I gotta take it, right? <laughs> yeah, of course. Yeah, but yeah. It, it feels like every time. You, it's That's really good. I, I mean, you gotta take the amount. Right? Every time I play Curator's is Amalgam. That's almost freezable, just for this this dude. I think I will. And Spawn is actually pretty decent. And too. Spawn, I can take Spawn, yeah. I like it. It looks good. Looks pretty toasty. Let me exchange these guys. Or you could take um, Noyo and Leaper if you wanted to. I could. And then just commit to playing Max. I could, yeah. Amalgam's are good for Max. Amalgam's good for everything. Amalgam is really good for Light Fang, it yeah, turns out. That's true. You know what would be really good? If um, if the, the uh, uh, starting Amalgam counted towards a triple. Yes. That was one of the things that annoyed me the most about it. That would be hellacious. Is that you... Not that it doesn't count towards the Amalgam triple, that makes yeah. sense. But that you just can't triple it at all, of course. Yes. So it just kind of always feels like a little bit of a dead minion on the board at the end. Yeah. Once you start having Amalgam so and stuff. So is basically given, and let's just... Let's just think for a second. This or this. Um, how, about, how many leapers do we get? I think I think we'll taunt. This is still correct, obviously. This does probably not matter. We got Sylvanas, who play who just had a Void Walker last time, and seems to not be doing too great. Which oh no, right demons, yeah. Um. Sylvanas has not a lot of health because demons. I assume we attack first, so I think this is correct. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna say it, but homunculus. Mm, yeah, maybe. You never. 
But you can only put up against one of the two, so... What are you watching? Neither, it turns Neither. out. What happened there? The old switcheroo. I mean, to be fair, that, that's, that's totally fair. Yeah. It's... Like, take the best stats on one. And take it. S sell it on three to get something and else. As the yeah. strategy emerges, you then do, yeah. That's exactly. That's I, I, I've done that before. So all that planning. Because before. I know that when I started playing this game mode, my biggest mistake was committing to a strategy too early. Yeah. I've, I've heard I've heard of that being mentioned, actually. Because it's like, if I get a Wrath Move on one... I really just want to play demons at that point. It's like, well, but now you get like three good mechs. It's like, yeah, n now you're playing mechs. Yes. It's, I'm sorry. How do we how do we build this up now? Is it uh, is it this order? Is it this order? Uh, one thing that I want to note is that I believe uh, the selfless heroes can hit a minion that already has the launch. Can I believe so? Yes. Uh, yeah, maybe. I'm not 100% on that, but I believe that is the case, in which case, this way it would have also made sense to put an oil early, so that it, mm, yeah, you don't just completely It's whiff. gonna die anyway, because it doesn't, it's not gonna get it, I guess. Murlux. Murlux. Do you want the Divine Shields on the, the best stuff, so having it on the Amalgam is, is preferable. Of course. I'm not sure, because... It, I want to say you've seen it, but it might have also just the hits been were a bad full anyway. board of the yeah, Divine Shield. The hits were terrible anyway, but maybe, I don't know. Alright, uh, we have to find some units here, some good units. Mm, don't think mini botches yet. This is very much good for amalgams. As is this, but I'm not, not sure if need was necessarily the correct uh, word there, even. You wanted. What? To get some more goods, roll for some more good stuff. Well, yes. You could have also just upgraded. Uh, I don't like to upgrade back to back turns because then it feels like you just fall behind too much. But in secret, you're actually getting ahead. No. No, you're not. <laughs> I don't think so, man. That's like taking, like, that's like getting a third degree instead of, like, a third degree after, or a fourth college degree after you already have thir a third one and you're like 37 years old. And you're like, oh yeah, you know what? Let me let me get a fourth degree, and then and then you except graduate, and you're just too old to work. What? Except that it more compares to saying um, your buying extra minions is kind of more like going to work for a couple of years after high school, so you have some money instead of just going to college directly and getting a higher paying job earlier. Well, but having some money might be necessary to pay for college, right? Well, let's just <laughs> assume we live in a first world country. Oh, yeah. Not everyone can assume that, America. I, I like taking shots at America for not being a first world country no, way too much. No, they're not, they're not. <laughs> Alright. Oh, the the, the is not bad. I can, I think I'll probably take that. Um, I want to get, I though I want to get to, um, to Junkbot rather quick. Exactly. Guardian. Boy. My thought. You don't currently have any summons, but that's... I mean, there is a Harvest Golden there, but... Yes. Uh, this part needs to go, as well as... This? Or I might keep it this turn and, up and do an next turn, maybe, but then I don't get this. Well, you do, uh, you do have one summon, but it's not a guaranteed max summon. Oh, oh, I'll do it like this, I think. It might it might, might have been the incorrect play. Um, it, it sort of just it depends, you don't know. <clears throat> I, I maybe should have played Guardian. I have no idea. I would have upgraded last turn, but would have completely gotten me out of that conundrum, probably. I should have got Guardian, sold another um, Divine Shield person, and then uh, gave the Guardian Divine Shield. But this is also a very strong lineup for some reason. Like, I got everything. Great. That's not a good matchup. So we gotta hope to get a couple different ones here. This is good. That's good. This is also good. Um, yeah, I think these are just too weak to justify keeping them around. Yeah, that point definitely comes. At some point, you just you gotta get rid of them. Nothing really there. Spawn is maybe fine. I'm not sure if it's a time for spawn, really. Spawn is more of a... Yeah early to mid game card and we're starting to approach the mid to late game phase so uh, I like it very this another too because I have the other one so I'll probably do like this. And 
just sit on that. Maybe. You can roll. And maybe freeze if you like the artist that much, but... It's alright, I'll, I'll probably take it, because I have, I have space to rotate and I have to get stats on the board. Because I'm losing to most people right now because of stats. I haven't gotten any of the more effective stuff, though, like, um, I haven't gotten the Noyo module. No, um... Well, Noyo module is 4 stars, I'm not yeah, mistaken, Cobalt, which you just now yeah. got. Cobalt Guardian is pretty good. Which you could have had, but you chose not to. Yeah, I'm gonna upgrade. Well, you chose not to freeze as well, so... Because, uh, yeah, upgrading and freezing seems weird. It does, that's Sometimes. true. I, I've done it before, but it, oh, it yeah. does feel weird. So. I'll, ta I'll play Elise again. Uh, that means I can't really upgrade now, can I? I never understood that, though. I mean, I guess, see, the thing is, if you were me, which I guess good for me, not that being... Oh, <laughs> good for me, he's not uh, me. <laughs> Let's just agree that we both appreciate it that way. And um, then you would have probably already be at five by now. So, but if uh, I'm if I'm down already, I can't just upgrade. Then you just lose faster instantly. What do I sell? That's the trick. You lose early, so you don't lose late. No, but if if you like if you like tur in turn six or seven, and you're still losing. That's not early anymore. That's you're then you're behind. It, they could say an R word, but that doesn't even mean the exact same thing I want to express. Cyclotron's interesting, but a bit unsure. I think I'll have to do it because Junkbot seems to be. I'm not. I'm not finding the minions that would help me without Junkbot gain any reasonable, any reasonable line up here. So I have to just find Junk. Just pray that I got Junkbot and uh, and have that carry. I feel like I get nothing else right now. Wow, this is just crushing. I mean, what is this? I mean, what is this lineup? Like Riven there and everything, really? What I mean, what is this? This is crazy. This might this might be over right now. Actually, I don't know how much he's doing, but Canoac does five. Sky Golem does like um, Sky Golem does four. Riven there like four or five. Shield Maybe does two. Dude, that that's crazy. I, what type of lineup is that? A reasonably strong yeah, one. We yes. should we should get that type of stuff on stream and stuff uh, on on video every once in a while. That would be. It would be fantastic. Or not. I mean, it's, it's really junk or, or boss at this point, I feel like. Yeah, I was gonna... It has to be, it has to be junk, but that's, that's the... I think this is reasonable. Uh, you only have one amalgam that would be hit. Yeah. And you don't... As, as much as it is a Mac, you're not keeping it, so... I think, like, Fast Root, maybe. With this, I guess. Uh, Defender, probably. Unless you're getting rid of both, but... It... Yeah. I mean, Defender just is just straight up a 2-3. I guess the Divine Shield is generally said to be worth 2 health, but... But it's not gonna be on the on the 2 might, attack minion, be, but on a bigger one. It might be able to high roll, so... so. Like, even if it lands on the Leaper, which is arguably the worst case, then the Divine Shield would still be worth more than if it was on the Selfless Hero itself. Maybe here. Sure. And yeah, we need uh, we need some kind of miracle. This this was not a good round in any stretch of the imagination, man. We did get none, none of the really impactful, impactful ones. How do we beat this? By not letting the war leaders live to the end, for example. I mean, you won. Yeah. I'm not sure what you're complaining about. I was still very so out. Uh, this is definitely a good one. No. I still need him. Um, if I can't get the um, the the bot the uh, the junk bot, I should have to stack up on the mountains, I suppose. You could also buy the demon. You have enough mana. I'm thinking you have enough coins. Or one of these. Like, how about the boogie monster? Is boogie monster good? I don't think so. Suspicious, right? Actually, I don't have a good point though. 
Do you think they'll remove minions at some point? I think so, yeah. They'll, they'll do because stuff. Because if yeah. they keep adding, the pool starts getting too diluted at some point, I think. Although, to be fair, the pool getting more differentiated would not be the worst thing. For a variety of reasons. Primarily that it makes troubles a little mm -hmm. harder. Which meh, is so-so. I think it makes the game more consistent if triples are yeah. harder. Meaning that um, luck is less of a factor a little bit. But then again... If you're looking for specific things, that comes more of a factor again, so... I wouldn't be surprised if they did it. We play the guy who just died, and he... he the thing is, this is, one, this is one of those trap games where you just... You just lose, no matter what you do. Because he's basically on the same level still, so you can't underestimate it, but... Nothing you can do. Not really what you want. See, that dog is pretty strong now. The mm, yeah, on, on our okay. again. See? It can happen. Yeah. Told you. Well, what am I supposed to do there against that, right? We need it on the amalgam specifically. No, but my point was the uh, the one who still had Divine Shield at the time got it, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah I, I know, no, no, but like you said it in a way as if I could have done something about it. No, I, I just, <laughs> I, I felt good about getting that fact correct. Yeah, I, I've never uh, paid attention to that specifically. We needed to get the Divine Shield back on the Amalgam or the Fast Food Hog, I think. Um, because on the, on the robot... Donut is everything below four. Ah, oh, interesting. Good to know. And the, allegedly, we, yeah, I mean, I am assume that that's the case. Um, and Crown is just one? Apparently, maybe. So we, if we get it on the amalgam, then I think we we should have a chance. If we then hit amalgam into amalgam, it's the last taunt. You know what I just noticed? What? I said something very similar to what happened. I said you get fourth and get plus nine. You ended up getting fifth and minus yeah. nine. So it does fourth get you plus nine, or is it? It's always like it's always different, right? I, I mean, it depends a lot on. I think it yeah. depends on who your opponents are, uh, where they are point wise, and on where you rank in between it. And I want to say it's not mirrored, but rather slightly favored on the winning side. It might. So that you're, okay. if you were to play 50-50, I think you would s still slowly advance. Maybe. At least at least at the lower rating points where so, we're at. So the situation is... It, it, might, it might be different once you're at like 10,000. You're probably going to yeah. like lose oh, yeah. points everywhere besides for first. But... Um, so the, the situation is pretty much the same as before. We need a good win to get to 5,000. I'm going to try the next time. But first it's JJ's turn again, obviously, on, on his account. Um, see what he can do, um, and uh, and then we we hunt for five thousand once again. I still believe I can do it before JJ. Oh uh, yeah, I mean you. Um, we just before this looked at the stats. Uh, I probably have posted them by the, on the Discord, Discord already. Yeah. Um, you played like three times as much. Three times as so far. Yes, that is that is true. Then again, I did have just as many wins as you did. I just didn't have as many. Well, I have one less, but uh, I didn't have as many top four finishes. So yeah, a lot of the the stats scaled pretty. Uh, Pretty much, except for to except for first places, which... yeah, or uh, like, like the, the ones that really don't, like um, biggest main and stuff. But the, they are very interesting, so I encourage everyone to definitely go check them. As a matter of fact, I can show it right now. Um, check out your uh, your stats if you've been playing Battlegrounds for a while and you haven't heard of this yet. Those stats are out now, so you can go check those out. It it shows you all the stuff, and it, I like how this is exactly six thousand right now. Uh, how did this happen? Eight uh, one third one th uh, thirty one. Um, that that demon that gains is a battle cry. Um, the Gained health according to the damage you took. And in then you had Bran? No, no, I had it in gold and I tripled it up. Oh, okay. And that was neat. I put it, I posted Dude. it on the Discord. That was pretty cool. But you know what I just thought of? And there's your stats. Yes. I, I mentioned you know. Bran, right? Yes. Imagine getting two of those with Bran and huh. then tripling him up oh. with Bran again. <sighs> Damn. And do that with uh, stitches at one health. Yeah, something like that. That was, that would have been, that would be insane, man. It seems you're very efficient with Bartender. Yes, Bartender Tron was my favorite hero before. I hope they bring it back soon. That, that's great. I love it. But uh, for now, we are done. Next time is Jay's turn again. But thank you for watching. Drop a like on this video. Subscribe to Trashkin TV and go join our Discord server. Do it. Link is in the description. You can talk to us and our community uh, in there. And it's going to be a fun experience for everyone involved, hopefully. Uh, we have a subreddit and a Twitter account, which are managed by Sergey. Not currently, but at some point they might. So just to be sure, go follow him. Links on the channel page and the description. And until next time, JJ. That's it. That's it.